那个问天实验舱，呃，那个。They are mainly doing life science experiments. There are cabinets, so-called racks of life, involving the ecosystem and biotechnology, and there are also glove boxes for samples the taikonauts collect in space. There are refrigerators with temperatures as low as minus 80 degrees Celsius. They will store samples and be brought back to Earth for further analysis. And there are also two cabinets for future use, because the space station will continue conducting experiments for at least another 10 years. And what is the significance and what are the purposes of doing these experiments?、Um, have they been done before, either by China or other countries? The purpose of the experiments involving the life ecological cabinets is to study the effects of microgravity on plants and animals in space. This is to lay a foundation for humans to one day live in space. The biotechnology cabinet focuses on cell experiments. It involves cells of bones as well as muscles. It's also for the future treatment of diseases in space, including bone loss and organ transplant, like the heart. Plus, more basic research. Would the experiments be conducted automatically or by the taikonauts? Uh, they are basically done automatically, and taikonauts would also look after them. For example, replacing them based on the progress of the orbital experiments or making adjustments. And so, how would the experimental results be sent back to Earth、um, for instant or constant analysis? For life science and material experiments in space, there are two ways. One is to get the images of the entire experimental change in orbit, and then transmit the images and data back to Earth for initial analysis. But for further research, we need to take the samples back to Earth and do research. Will these experimental results be shared with the international community? The international cooperation is a relatively important part of our science experiments in space. The current projects during the space station construction phase is sharing samples, for example, the crystallization of protein, and we are planning deeper and more systematic international cooperation.